Hello, welcome back to Double Punch Pro Nerfer. So, I am back with another video, and we have a guest for this one. Drum roll, please. His name is CR Nerf. So, today I'll be reviewing the Darzon Max Venom Pro, and yeah, let's get into what it comes with. All right, so what does the Darzon Max Venom Pro come with? Well, it comes with two of these slim angled talon style mags. They work with the Nightingale and they work with the Nightingale 2.0 and they work with the Venom Pro. And it also comes with 24 of these bamboo darts. They're actually an extra shot plus, but they look like bamboo darts. There's an extra ring into it. They actually look like bamboo 2X darts. But these do weigh a little over a gram. But uh, yeah. And it also comes with a blaster, the 2S 7.4 volt 1000 milliamp battery. You can also put a 3S lipo in there if it has an XT30 connector, which I actually have one in my bedroom. But uh, yeah, and also comes with eyewear, which I won't be needing for this video. So let's get into the overview. All right, so the overview of the Dark Zone Max Venom Pro. Well, starting off at the front. No one's like barrel lug. It's got the barrel, which you can actually put a scar barrel that came with the, uh, or a P car, I mean, that came with the uh, Aeon Pro X and Nexus Pro X and Max Factor 2.0, which I don't have yet. I already have the Aeon Pro X and Nexus Pro X. But uh, then up here we have the thumb screw, which is where the battery goes. And it works great. It's definitely better than using a screwdriver. The dart is covering the battery because the battery that it comes with is a little loose in there. And yeah, and then at the top, we do have a sight, which I don't really like that sight, but it does have a Picatinny rail, and it has the sight back here lining up with that. And then on this side, we have the flywheels with the vents, and there's also other vents on this side. And then also on this side, we have the safety switch, and it's on safety, but if I put it in forward, I can actually rev it. And it has a very fast rev time. It's revving up in like one second. 130 FPS too, which is actually pretty good. And yeah. And then right here we have the trigger. You can't pull the trigger without revving it. But uh, yeah. And speaking of rev trigger, it's back here. I thought it was going to be a dual stage trigger at first, but... It's got this rev trigger back here, and surprisingly, it doesn't bother me at all. It's actually very comfortable. But uh, then we got the mag release on this side, which only works on this side unless you flip it around to work on this side, which you could do that if you open up the blaster. And yeah, then we got the grip down here. It's very comfortable, surprisingly. And then up here, we do have a sling mount, too. I forgot to mention that. And yeah, and the mag insertion is very smooth. So smooth, you can grab it. I think they actually um, made this a flared magwell, which is actually awesome if they did. And it does shoot seven rounds a second. You can also fire it in semi auto. Literally. It's just that easy. So, yeah. Now, let's get into CR Nerf doing the firing demo. Hey, everybody. CR Nerf here. Uh, we're going to do some firing footage with the Venom Pro. Uh, Double Punch Pro Nerfer reached out and asked if I would do some firing footage for him. And so, since I love uh, sharing the hobby and growing the hobby, I said yes. So we're going to try to do this so you can actually see what I'm doing. We're going to try a couple of uh, single shots first, and then we'll do some full auto. And now full auto, which is not practical, but a whole heck of a lot of fun. All right, thank you guys, take care. All right, so what are my final thoughts on the Dart Zone Max Venom Pro? So let's go over the pros and cons and we'll get into the final thoughts. So 
I don't really have any cons about it, but I have a lot of pros. So uh, the first pro is they actually let us have a thumb screw instead of a regular screw where you need a screwdriver. And another pro is this grip is great. And yeah. And then another pro is flared magwell which is really good and yeah but the biggest pro of them all is it's fun in full auto and semi-auto so yeah there's not really much cons but there is one this site the site is not good definitely will be using that site but it's not the best but uh yeah no, what are my final thoughts on, th on this thing, though? Well, overall, it's a very great blaster. It's fun to hold. It's fun to shoot in full auto, although it's not practical, like CR Nerf says in the firing demo. And, yeah, but semi-auto is really fun. But the I don't have the battery plugged in for me to rev it. I unplugged it after the um, overview. But, uh, yeah. Other than that, this is a great blaster. For 50 bucks, you get two mags. You get two 12 dart mags. You get 24 darts. You get eyewear, the blaster, rechargeable, 7.4 volt, 1,000 milliamp battery. And yeah, it's pretty great. So, yeah, you get a lot of stuff for 50 bucks. But, uh,. Yeah, that, those are my final thoughts. Don't forget to smash the like button, comment, subscribe, and thank you to CR Nerf for being in this video. And Double Punch Pro Nerf are out. Peace.